Hello everyone! I am Emmanuel Sam, Game Sangkap of 5 SSES. For this video, I will be doing another integrative output in science and math. I will create a scale model of the Great Pyramid in a simple circuit. In this activity, I will learn how to build a solid figure and at the same time discover how electricity moves through conductive materials. Are you excited to learn with me? Come on! Join me in completing this activity. Let us first prepare all the materials needed for this activity. For the scale model pyramid, I will be using the following. Board paper, scissor, glue, popsicle sticks, and glue gun. On the other hand, I will be using the following materials for building my simple circuit. Illustration board, battery, switch, socket and light bulb, copper wires, electrical tape, screwdriver, and scissor. Do you know what a pyramid is? The oldest and largest great pyramid structures are found in Egypt. They are interesting examples of solid figures built by humans. Yes, you heard it right. Pyramid is a solid figure or a polyhedron that has a polygonal base and a flat triangular faces, which join at a common point called the apex. Come on, let us now create our pyramid. First, let us find and print a pyramid pattern template in a board paper. Then, cut the pyramid pattern and draw multiple parallel lines on each side of the pyramid. Next, fold the pattern according to its triangular face and polygonal base and glue each side together to create the pyramid shape. Let it dry and put the popsicle stick as the curve of the pyramid object. Here is our scale model of the Great Pyramid. Wow! That was fun! But we are not done yet. Let us now do another fun activity. If you want something to work, like your computer or a flashlight, you need to have the electricity move through a circuit. A circuit is a path through which the electricity flows. To understand more about this, let us build a simple electric circuit. First, strip the ends of the insulated wires. Using a screwdriver, loosen each screw on the light bulb socket and attach the exposed wires to the screw. Afterwards, lighten the screw and ensure that the metal wires remain in contact with the screw. In this activity, the batteries will be the power source of the light bulb. With that, attach the other end of the wires from the light bulb to the batteries and switch while the switch will control the flow of the electricity. Use electrical tape to put the simple electric circuit in place. Also, put the labels in each part of the circuit. Ayan! I am now done with this activity. Here is a scale model of the Great Pyramid in a simple electric circuit. Do you 
see the light passing through our pyramid? This pyramid is an example of a translucent object. It allows some light to pass through, but the produced images seen from the other side of the material are not clear. So that's it! I hope you have learned from this simple performance task. Thank you for watching this video! Bye!